Umma gumba, umma gumba, umma gumba, do I umma gumba. I am getting a hair transplant in Hair Restoration Black Rock. I've noticed my hair receding for a while. Uh, I even notice it sometimes looking like a wig about to fly off if the wind blows in a certain direction. We've come to the amazing Istanbul, which is a gorgeous city full of amazing food and culture. Wow. Hello. It's William struggling. So Istanbuli. But the hair restoration industry is largely unregulated. It's something HRBR is pushing for. A lot of people come here to kind of get a cheap fix. Um, so we're going to see some of the clinics today and we'll report back. I'm basically Louis Thoreau on the hunt for a new wig. So follow me. So I have just arrived to our first clinic and I'm going to go in for a consultation. Uh, clinic one of three we're visiting today. So I'll go in, get the consultation and report on it when I come back out. See you in a minute. It's kind of fancy. How much does it cost? What's the region? So I'm just out of my first consultation. Um, it was an experience. It was a very manically busy clinic. When I got in, um, they asked me if I wanted a job. That was the first question that came out. And then I met this really lovely lady and she took me into a room and she just asked me to lift up my hair. And I lifted up my hair and someone else walked in at that point, I think her manager or something. So she only actually caught a glimpse of like my hair and forehead for like two seconds. And then she immediately then gave me a diagnosis. Um, from that like one second of seeing my hairline and told me that I could get 100% full coverage if I had this certain operation she was recommending and I could get 2,000 hair follicles put in. Um, so it was just slightly dodgy that she was able to say all, the, all of that from just seeing my hairline for like two seconds. So yeah, really lovely lady, um, slightly odd uh, consultation. Okay, we could not come to Istanbul and not come to the gorgeous Blue Mosque. It looks magical. So we're gonna go in and have a little look now. So come on. It's so cool, isn't it? So high. I kind of want one of those pretzel things. Do you want one? Yeah. So I'm just out of my second consultation there. Um, I guess probably the most off-putting thing about it was I went into the consultation room and uh, they weren't doctors, but they took photos of my head and then sent them to their doctor and then got a diagnosis back within I don't know, 10 minutes and were able to tell me exactly what they can do and for what price. Now, the price was pretty amazing. It included three nights accommodation, airport transfers and everything. So I can kind of see why you might be sucked into it quite easily. But um, this whole industry is completely unregulated and that is something that uh, HRBR is kind of pushing for. They would like it to be regulated so you can kind of separate the good ones from the bad ones. Yeah, that consultation was a bit odd in that they diagnosed me on the spot, but through a doctor that wasn't in the room. Look how stunning these bins are. Just pop your rubbish in there. Down into the depths. Genius. No touching. Love. Stunning. 
I'm at the Grand Bazaar, this stunning indoor market full of spices and teas and dried flowers. I have a list of things I have to get from William. So follow me in and check it out. I'm so excited. Hi. Can I get some spices, please? 